Wait, a product that's reasonably priced? This can't be. <gasps> Zero eleven here, and today we got a retail box of seventeen eighteen Upper Deck Series One Hockey, featuring eight cards per pack, twenty four packs per box. In the retail box, we're getting six young guns, fifty fifty shot at the canvas young guns, and actually, we're guaranteed a jersey card, among several other things. So seventeen eighteen Series One, I'm revisiting this because, well, this box cost sixty dollars Canadian, which is kind of unheard of in twenty twenty one. Have a box that's reasonably priced because here's the top five young guns. Here's what they're going for. I mean, this isn't necessarily value. This is just the players I think are the top five, but. With several players, you can get a large chunk of your money back. And also, McAvoy and Heischer usually go together, so if you get both of those in one box, you're good. So yeah, the craft for 1718 Series 1, pretty deep, but the top really ain't great. So number one is kind of flip-flop. I personally think it's the Brinkett. McAvoy is number two. But there's a lot of solid NHLers on the checklist. There's players still with upside. There's a player that I'm looking to hunt in here, so there's a lot of good things going on with this product. Now, yes, it's very cheap. Probably because this stuff was overproduced. Back in 2017, the five of you that remember, I actually bought like a bunch of mega boxes of this stuff when it went on sale for really cheap. There was just so much of it out there. And there's a bunch of these retail boxes still out there. Like, you pretty much see everybody selling these. Now, granted, there's not a big-name rookie in here to hunt, so maybe that's why you still see so much. But regardless, 60 bucks. Chance at some quality rookies. Like, why not? So, yeah, let's get right into 1718 Series 1. Okay, retail box. I have opened this in the past. I've opened everything. 1718 Series 1. It's right before I sold all my young guns. I was opening 1718 Series 1. I still got several miscellaneous 1718 young guns laying around. But, yeah, let's just get one of the top five in here or get a Josh Hosang. That's pretty simple. So here's the base from 1718. Solid design. Typical flagship upper deck there. So we got Simmons, Matt Niskanen, Forsberg, Kadri, Connor McDavid. Shining stars. So there's a regular shining stars of McDavid third year there. That's a nice card right there. Always nice getting McDavid stuff. Backstrom, Ekholm, and William Nylander. Okay, second pack here. We got Thomas Grice, Jason Spezza, Luongo. Oh, canvas. Nice canvas there. John Tavares. Still on the Islanders there. There's that. Uh, Brady Shea, Curry Lettinen, Alec Martinez, and Pavel Zach. Still no young guns in here, but might be one here. Miles Wood, Seth Jones, Jacob Slavin, Jonas Brodine, and John Tavares. Again, beauty portraits. Rensky, Stahl, and Dumba. Triple card. Okay, the big canvas back then at least was Clayton Keller. Not so much anymore. Was Patrick a camp? He might be. I don't know if he's really desirable anymore, but Fowler. Akpozo, Brian Little, Alex Fermentin. I actually have this one. Young Guns. There's a player with upside, one of Ottawa's many young forwards. Let's see if he can break through and have a full-time role next year with the Sen. Great skater there, so. BX, uh, Molson, Morrissey, and Henry. Okay, next pack up here, we got Rene, Haglin, Mantha, Sutter, uh, Malkin, Nyquist, Granlin, Crawford. Okay, this is four years ago now at this point, 1718. Seabrook, Stepniak, Helm, Raquel, and Jeff Carter. Shining Stars Red. There's Carter. Aho, Larson, and Kessler. There's actually quite a few players already out of the league here, which is a little bit surprising, but we got Arturi Lekkinen, Colton Sevier, Blake Como, OEL, Beauty Canvas, him against the Canucks there, his new team, but huh. there's Price, Derek McKenzie, Varlamov, Ekman Larson. Okay, only got one young guns this far. Got Toby Reader, Cole, Petrie, Jack Eichel, and Robert Hag. Young guns. Yeah, I feel bad for Hag. He is now a member of the Buffalo <laughs> Sabres, so. Yikes. But there you go. He's part of the rest of the line in trade. Robert Hag, young guns. He's a decent defenseman there, so. There you go. And we got Murray, Byron, and McCabe. Next pack up here, we got Matheson, Froelich, MacArthur. Oh, portrait. Tyson Joe, rookie portrait, say. Trocek, Backlund, Brassard, and Dvorak. Getting close to halfway through. Only got two young guns this far. Goligoski, Taylor Hall, Rick Nash, Jay Beagle, and AVR. Shining Stars. Just a regular one. <laughs> regular one there. Zajac, Hayes, and John Carlson. Okay, we got Palat, Demers, Berchi, Chikrin, Matthews, Huberto, Stetcher, Domi. Base pack. All right, last pack of the left side. This is the halfway point of the box. Let's see what we get in here. There's Peter Morazic, Table Teravainen, Arvidsson. Riley Sheahead, Cam Ward, Yaron Crook, another base pack, Leo Comer. All right, second half here. What do we got? Two young guns, just Hag and Formenton. Uh, we got the checklist, 2017 Cup final there with Rene and Murray. There's Brown, Provorov, and Canvas, Mike Matheson. UD Canvas there. Markstrom, Quick, Voracek, Pesci. We still need some young guns here. We got Brody, Sedlak, Coyle, Bacchus. Bobrovsky, Stahl, Krug, Schmaltz. Quite a few base packs here. Okay, come on, Young Gun. Hayes, Parise, Pajot, Stajan, Baxter, Portraits, Shaw, Hoffman, Kachuk. Come on, where the heck are they? Matt Benning, Dion, <laughs> Zekera, CJ Smith, Young Gun. That's not a great one right there. Smith, I'm not even sure where he is at this point. I'll throw it up because I'm not entirely sure there's CJ Smith. There you go. Uh, Maroon, Taurus, Kajula, Zucker. Also still expecting a jersey card in here. We still need a few Young Guns as well, so Spurs. Green, Dano, Jenner, and we got another Shining Stars. Arvidsson, Shining Stars. Uh, Beauvillier, Weber, and Roussel. 
Uh, Monahan, Subban, Zetterberg, Rantanen, Brower, Fiala, Glendening, McKinnon. It should be coming here, right? More of them. Vasilevsky, Foxo. Uh, we got a canvas. Eller and Pavel Zaka. UD canvas of Zaka there, huh? Okay. Strawman, Hamuse. Mmm, there's Cozy. And Petrangelo. All right, next up here, Paul Martin, Joel Ward, Kopitar, Konechny, and Adrian Kempe. Young guns. That's not too bad there. Full-time NHLer. Hasn't really reached his true potential there, but still a solid player there, Kempe. I mean, the Kings are going to have a lot of young forwards coming up, so we'll see what happens with Kempe. Maybe that'll boost his production. We'll see, but there's going to be a lot more players vying for spots up front. So there's Kempe, Braun, Forbor, Philpola. All right, four packs. We need a jersey card. We need a couple of young guns, I'm pretty sure. There's Flurry, First Year Vegas, card Dowd, Dreisaitl, Dougie Hamilton, Portraits. Garrison, Lewis, Latestu, Kucherov. Final three packs here. Let's see. Point. Is there a jersey? Yeah, it's a jersey. Okay. Barry, Lowry, and Ryan Spooner. UD Game jersey. I'm pretty sure he's in the KHL. Yeah, there's a Spooner UD Game jersey. Not too great there. At least get Game U jersey there. So, Ryan Spooner. Once traded for Ryan Strome to the Oilers. Anybody remember that? That was a good trade for the Rangers. But there you go. There's Spooner, Soderbergh, Wheeler. Well, there's two packs left. We've pulled four young guns. We need two young guns. Let's see who they are, and hopefully we actually get them. Harder to tell with 17, 18 if there's a young guns by doing that. Look at that. Is there one there you can't even tell what's the back of these look like hold on oh well they look the same as the base on the back there didn't even realize that but uh let's see if we get one here jt miller jane schwartz wrist aligning well it's this base dang it yeah short of young guns jeez is there one in here at least uh yeah there's one in here it is will butcher okay young guns so we got another new buffalo sabers defenseman yikes but yeah that was a really rough retail box really rough what the heck yeah guys there's a retail box of 17 18 series one we should have got six young guns we got five not terrible not terrible players but that was a rough box in general it was only 60 bucks though so it's kind of hard to complain but there's that as always thanks for watching and i'll see you guys later. All right, now on to the young guns. I got sleeves on all these, so it's gonna be glare, but all right, we'll start off with uh, singles here that only got one of. I actually got eight duplicates, which is kind of unfortunate. Well, it's, it's really fortunate for one card, but unfortunate for oh, two cards. Three cards. We got the legend, Josh Hosang. Very nice. I might actually just keep this Josh Hosang. And we got Lucas Walmart, Chittle, Tuck. It's the same one I got from my uh, one I record on YouTube. And we got uh, Ian McCushion, Vlad Kamenev, Hayne Flurry. Oh, we got McCushion Dupe. Yeah, we got nine duplicates out of nine blasters. I got Samuel Moran, uh, Rasmus. Anderson and CJ Smith. Now on to the duplicates. Ian McCushion. And we have John Gillies. Dennis Gurionov. This is a nice one. Kyler Yamamoto. Sorry for the lighting here. I sleeved them up. They're not in top loaders yet because I don't have top loaders, but I'll find a way. Two Alex Debrincat. That's pretty sweet. Uh, we got two Kerfoots. Pretty cool as well. Uh, we got two John Hayden. Two Nathan Walkers, the Australian. That's pretty cool. And we got two Brock Besser. So I did not get a Nico Heischer. Well, kind of did. I got the Jungle's checklist, which I'm going to check that quickly. But, um, yeah, I got two Brock Besters, which is really nice. Um, I can't believe how much this card's going for. Unbelievable. Well, he's having an unbelievable rookie year, so I guess it's warranted. Huh. Interesting. So yeah, not even close to the young gun set from that because I got nine duplicates. So yeah, there's the recap of nine boxes. Honestly, I'm happy. All right. Definitely some good, uh, good pieces that have good value, like the Parker's Red and... Besters, yeah, Momoto is pretty decent value, but um, Austin Matthews right there probably doesn't do too bad. But yeah, guys, that's what I got from nine blasters of that stuff. <laughs>